Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley says the government will continue to fund the Children's Authority even in the wake of a damning report that reveals cases of child abuse were found at several children's homes. The report by retired Justice Judith Jones, which looked into the management of children's homes during the period July 2021 to December 2021, was laid in the Parliament on April 29th by Minister in the Office of the Prime Minister, Ayanna Webster Roy. At Thursday's post-Cabinet media conference at the Diplomatic Center, the Prime Minister said while the findings of the report are disheartening, government is satisfied that the objective was met. We assure the population that as, go as a government, we remain resolute in this objective and with the support of all stakeholders, will continue to ensure that continuing action is taken to strengthen the country's child protection systems in keeping with our national and international commitments. According to the report, many of the facilities looked into were unlicensed. The Prime Minister said the government notes the calls in the public domain for the closure of some homes, but the government is committed to providing the necessary resources to ensure the well-being and upkeep of the children. While we understand the emotions that ran high when the matter was laid in the Parliament, we also understand the political aspect of it from those who seek to make political mileage out of it and to call for the government to stop feeding the children and to stop funding the agency. That is just not a sensible way.